Hi, and welcome to Crypto Crazy. I'm Cal, and today I'm going to talk to you about a relatively new coin called SafeSun. Now, before I start, you've probably seen a number of coins out there. Obviously, you have SafeMoon, then you've seen a lot of other safe coins too. It seems to be something that the crypto communities want to get behind. A lot of these community coins that are deflationary, auto staking, they have fair sales as well, that community want to get within, be a part of and develop and see what they can make as part of that community coin as well. Now, I'm going to cover this. One thing I will mention is with these type of coins, they are much more higher risk. Now, cryptocurrency is high risk anyway, but these type of coins are quite high risk and I think it's always worth having a balanced portfolio. So you can have some larger coins, obviously that don't fluctuate as much and don't have as much risk within the crypto world, medium sized coins, smaller coins, and then maybe a very small percentage in these new community coins, which have the potential for many Xing, but then obviously there is a potential that nothing comes of it as well. However, there are so many out there that I think there is it's worth having a look and see which ones that could potentially have value that have got people behind it now and look like they're getting some traction. So I'm just going to talk to you about Safe Sun today. Now, as you can see, it's gone up pretty much a 300% in the last 24 hours. It's a considerable amount. The fully diluted market cap is pretty much the market cap at the moment because they showed the max supply is the total supply. They've got a fair amount of volume. The volume has increased a significant amount. But as you can see, the the, the volume is over 2,000%. So the 300% move in price is pretty much justified. Now, this may come down a little bit, potentially. Potentially not. It's always hard to know. Some people want to buy on dips. But let me go through this and you can decide what your risk appetite for this as well is. So this shows that it's been listed on coin market cap about seven days ago. However, this project did come out about just over a month ago. And during that time, it's been kind of getting more people behind it. It's actually now available on two exchanges. So generally we see these on PancakeSwap only, but this is available on BitMart. You can see they've got a considerable amount of volume there as well. And this was only listed on BitMart at the end of April, as you can see here, the 29th of April. So they're certainly making some tractions there as well, which I think is pretty good. So let's get into what they do. If we just have a look at the, the coin, it's very much one of those sort of typical community coins where it says uh, you, you, you earn by holding it. There's a liquidity that's locked as well. And it's the, the usual sort of things that you expect from this sort of protocol. So if we just go through the basic 100% community driven, your static rewards, that's for holding it. You 2% of all the taxes on each transaction go directly to the holders. There's a limited supply. Um, and in actual fact, a, a large amount of it was actually burnt as well. And it talks about how it's safe and so on. But here's the more important thing. So what is this coin doing next? What do they want to do? And it says the SunSafe team has many other projects in line for its investors, including two NFTs and a decentralized exchange called SunSwap. And that's something that they have just now started as well. I'm just going to show you that in a minute while after we've kind of gone through this. And that's what we like to see, the fact that they are actually trying to do something. They are trying to make something that brings value to the coin. And it isn't just about holding it because you think it's going to go up in value. So here it talks about the, the general sort of mission of the coin. It's very much what we just kind of spoke through now at the moment as well. Token distribution. And this is what I was talking about being burnt, 51% was burnt. It says it's a fair sale, so I can only assume the 5% was actually bought at the start by the team and the marketing as well team. And here, the 44% then ended up being bought by other individuals. The usual sort of frequently asked questions, as they mentioned here, they are, and I've just shown as well, they are on CoinMarketCap. They're looking to get listed on CoinGecko as well. That gets more people looking at it to the usual sort of questions that you ask are you associated with safe moon no they're not they are a completely different project as well 
you can have a look at these other questions but it's the usual sort of thing yes the liquidity is locked for three years as well which is the sort of things we expect to see so quarter one we had the initial coin distribution yeah we've seen that the safe launch um, and uh, marketing starts they're going to get listed this month as well which was this quarter which we've seen they want to get on other exchanges too and towards the end of the year they're going to have their decentralized exchange up and running pretty well they're going to have uh, the nfts too and i think they're going to start a second one as well second nft based on the propriety ai platform now these sort of things are all very well in the roadmap and it's worth having a look and seeing how they progress against that if you are interested on it now they're all across the the usual social media platforms and just before i go into that let's actually have a look at what they have in terms of a swap now this is very very basic um but they do have what you would expect so if you have a, a swap of bnb to safe sun you can connect your wallet and you can have a look at other coins as well so not only those they have a significant amount that you would expect to see so that is pretty good in terms of the pool they they you can create liquidity as well and i think this is something that's going to be coming and you can you can have these pairs too so you can create whatever pair you want and there'll be more and more liquidity pools i imagine too but at the moment it is very much just starting up and i think this is something that can develop we can't see if anyone has actually used this at the moment to see if there is a certain volume but again it's something that you could potentially keep an eye on and when they would start announcing that they are doing uh, more volume or any volume through the swap their white paper is pretty basic i think uh, it has the usual sort of detail it might have been something that they kind of created earlier on this looks very like safe moon and their roadmap so it potentially needs a bit of an update it has that sort of feel i think generally at the start to get a bit of traction there's that association of it looks the same it feels the same maybe it can do the same sort of thing but once they've got their their groundwork going i think that obviously they have to make it their own too so just in terms of the 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 community behind it on telegram they've got nearly thirty three thousand followers on uh twitter as well 25 and in terms of holders they have they have 22000 so it looks and and this is just what you can see on pancake swap so as i mentioned the volume on bit bitmart is is higher by percentage it's significantly higher than pancake swap so probably about well as it shows there 60% goes through bitmart so this amount here is only that of pancake swap so there would be more holders in bitmart as well so something worth considering so overall i think it's one of those coins that has started off pretty much just saying safe sun and people think that it's going to go up in value as well they've certainly got the community behind it they've got uh, a bitmart listing they're, they're getting onto platform listings like coin market cap and will be on coin gecko as well they're building a community now they have ideas of what to do as well you've seen there they have their swap they want to get into nfts as well that swap let's see what they do with that if they can get more people using it and i imagine with, with a lot of these type of coins the people who are buying this coin who are holding this coin because they want to support it would use that swap they would use that liquidity pool that's where the volume comes and as that happens pretty much like this coin as it starts to gain traction people see and they say okay this looks safer now there are more people holding it they do have a plan and i think similarly for the swap and for the pools people they, they'll see people are using it and think okay this has credibility this is safe as well and it's growing we we're happy to not only invest but to use what they have as well in terms of a swap and a pool so it sounds like an interesting project like i mentioned there are a lot of these out there at the moment it's worth having a look if you are interested you don't have to be there is a lot of talk of, of these type of coins you don't have to be but if you are and I, I i always recommend a smaller amount because you never know what's going to happen in the crypto world so i always try to take a balanced risk approach and i think that's always a good idea in the last bull run it, that wasn't my approach 
my approach was very much the very high risk coins for very high reward however as we saw when they turn down 98 99 percent of the value can be lost if there is a crash it doesn't happen immediately but it does slowly go down and some of those coins some of those projects acts actually disappeared uh, and, and there were various reasons for that a lot of them were holding ethereum for their value uh, and ethereum lost it so they lost their cash as well so it's something to bear in mind it's something to to remember but from my perspective i come across these i know this is quite popular it's gone up people are asking about this so i'd like to cover it and bring not only what they're doing as well but my new views on it as well so there you go that's safe sun hope you found that interesting and informative if you have please do give me a like it does help the channel please consider subscribing i do bring out quite a wide range of videos if you have any questions ask in the comments if you're interested in any coins as well i do try to do research on quite a few i try to find out additional information if i can to bring it to you and so if that sounds something that you like please do consider subscribing but there you go that's safe son I've been Cal, this is Crypto Crazy, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.